Hi, Dom McFragman here with the Ahead Wicked Chops practice pad and the Wicked Chops tip of the week, helping you to focus your practice time and get better results faster from the world's tiniest practice pad. In the past few videos, we've been talking about controlling our strokes by playing away from the surface. So let's look more at that uh, by making wrist strokes. Playing with wrist strokes gives us a control and power without the sloppiness of overusing bounce. So to focus on making the, the wrist strokes, let's isolate each hand and concentrate on making the entire stroke all the way up and down from the wrist only, no arms and no bounce. And then we can go into playing some rudiments, singles, all wrists, no bounce, doubles, all wrists, no bounce, flams, all wrists, no bounce, and drags, all wrists, no bounce. Play through each of these stickings, making every single stroke from the wrist. Using this technique will help you to better play on the Wicked Chops practice pad, the drums, or any other surface. So yeah, check it out, and tune in next week for the Wicked Chops tip of the week. And remember, if you practice, you cannot avoid progress. See you next time.